Hey everybody, Mr. Cannon here for your proposal screencast for Senior Project. Let's get in, shall we? All right, so what is the proposal? Well, the proposal is a form, it's a sheet uh, that will act as sort of a map or a guide to describe what you might want to do during your Senior Project journey. It's not really a commitment of what you plan to do so much as it is the working out of a couple of ideas that you might do. So, so what does that really mean? Well, during quarter one in Senior Project, we want you to spend time brainstorming what you think you might want to do for a project and what it might actually entail to do that project. Will it work? What are some ways to make it work? That kind of stuff. And the proposal form is really just a series of questions that you answer that get you thinking about different parts of the project to make sure that it sort of has the legs that it needs to carry you on for the eight month journey of senior projects. And at the end of the day, the goal here is to try to work out some of the big kinks because uh, knowing that you have a good project at the beginning is really going to help in the long run. So here we go. On that proposal form, there are three main aspects that you need to think about. And believe it or not, there are screencasts already on the Senior Project website for all three of these things. So you can sort of go and check those out and see what they're all about. But just as a sort of brief recap of those things, the AOK -okay is the application of knowledge. It's like the thing that you do, the thing that you produce, create, etc. Um, the outside expert is a person who is an expert in the field of the topic of your senior project. And um, so the proposal form gets you thinking about who that outside expert might be, where you might go to find them, what it might sort of take for you to go in and find them. And lastly, the research. And the research part of the senior project is the stuff that you need to learn, the expertise you need to acquire in order to fulfill the, the project journey. And so on the proposal form, sort of ask you some ideas about, you know, where you might go to find that research or what that research might look like. So uh, the proposal form asks students to spend time thinking about those three aspects. The more planning that is done in quarter one, the better project will be. And that's pretty true, right? Um, what does the actual proposal form look like? Well, it is a Google Doc. It is a, a Google document that you can download from the Senior Project website, and you can fill it out either electronically or you can print it and fill it out by hand and then rescan it if you want. Um, but it's basically just a series of open-ended short answer questions in which you uh, are required to just answer them. There's some about the AOK. -okay. What are you thinking about on the AOK? -okay? OE, what are you thinking about there? Research, where are you thinking about going to get that? So answer all those questions and all the sub questions. Once that is done, you need to put it in your quarter one senior project folder in Google Drive. And as is the case with all senior project uh, work, you should always check to make sure that the privacy settings in the sharing settings show that anyone with the link can view. Okay, so just double check that, make sure it's all good so your senior project mentor can actually read it and check it out, give you feedback. All right, so that's pretty pretty much it. Pretty simple, pretty straightforward, but you may still have questions. If you do, ask your senior project mentor. Um, they're the best go-to person. Uh, if you need another set of eyes or uh, something like that, you can always go to the senior project study hall room, which is on the third floor, currently in room 348, but could change. Just look for the signs on the door. Or you could ask me, Mr. Cannon, signing off, on your proposal screencast.